What's up, everybody, and welcome to the Bears Profit Plays YouTube channel. If you enjoyed the content in this video, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel below. Also, be sure to stick around to the end of this video for a quick message from our team. Let's get into the video. All right, Trey, let's get into some NBA player props for Thursday, May 18th, slate of games. Before we get into the honeypot and the winner of the player prop bracket challenge, we are releasing our member YouTube plays today. You guys can access those by buying our YouTube memberships. We have two to offer. Go check those out, the Bear Pack and the Bear Pack Gold. Huge shout-out to Juan Jose Ramirez. He is the first one to purchase this. I don't want to tell you guys to buy it, but I want to explain the situation. The pecking order, it goes the site picks. We go MLB player prop, MLB pick, NBA player prop, NBA pick. Then we have YouTube member plays. Same thing there. By the time we get to these YouTube free plays, the pickings are slim, but Trey and I, we dive deep into trying to find you guys' plays. I think we do a decent job. Our record is not where we want it to be for these free plays, and you guys let us know in the comments sometimes, but we love seeing that. We love the comments. But I just want to explain a little bit. There's a lot of stuff that we have to pick before getting these free plays. So fair warning, if you guys can, go purchase the YouTube membership plays. We do much better on our member plays than we do on our free plays. But let's take a look at the honeypot tray. You guys are trying to pick five straight correct picks on player props. Now you for a chance to win $25 in one-year membership to our website. We are on day number two. Max Struss over 11.5 points will be the play tonight. The game has not started. We are recording before the game. So day three is going to be up in the morning. I believe in you guys. Go vote for that in the community tab on our YouTube page. Now, Trey, let's do the winner of the player prop bracket challenge. The winner is Daryl Williams, an absolute dog, winning with another dog as his play, Austin Reeves, over threes. Daryl, drop your email in the chat, or one better, send us an email by going to our website, clicking the support tab, and our email pops up for you so we can get you set up for that one-year membership to our website. Guys, we will be doing another game for the finals. We're going to take a break on these player prop bracket challenges. Those final games, we're going to drop those on Monday. So tune in Monday. We're going to go through all the rules. We're going to take 10 people from the Bear Pack community. It's going to be great. It's going to be awesome. There's going to be a $100 cash prize, so be on the lookout for that, Trey. Let's get into our plays from last night. Start us off. Yeah, I'm 0-0 zero for zero so far. Like Bear said, we are recording before the game start, but I gave out Malcolm Brogdon over five and a half three pointers attempted versus the Heat. Bear, you told me to remind you to put in that prop. This is me reminding mm -hmm. you to go put in that prop because it has a very good chance to cash. I love our odds. Brogdon's been throwing up the three-pointer all postseason long, and it does not have any reason to change tonight. So I'm hoping Brogdon hits. I need to go 1-0 for you guys. I did put in your play, and I paired it with the play of Bam Adebayo, over 17.5 points, which is my play tonight. Hopefully he does hit. I'm looking for a good game tonight. I want to watch some good basketball tonight. So hopefully both our plays hit and we get a good game. But, Trey, let's take a look at our playoff props for tonight. Start us off. Yeah, and mine is going to be AD, Anthony Davis, over 3.5 blocks plus steals versus the Nuggets. That's what the BS stands for down there, if you were wondering. And we saw in the second half of the game, my Lakers came charging back from their big deficit. It was due to a perfect second half adjustment from Darvin Ham putting Ruri Hachimura on Nikola Jokic and letting AD go back to his normal role of roaming the paint. And that allowed Davis to absolutely dominate in the paint and in the passing lanes. He finished game one with a total of five blocks and steals. He finished with three steals and two blocks. I think that there's a good chance for AD to even hit this number on blocks alone. And we have seen him impact the defensive end throughout this postseason. And I think he's going to love to be able to roam the paint, block the shots, and also steal the passing lanes. So I love this over of Anthony Davis, over three and a half blocks plus steals. He's going to come out with a fiery passion on the defensive end, and he's going to get a few for us. So let's go, Anthony Davis. I believe in you. Trey, this is not scripted. I swear to God, this is not scripted. You talked about Rui. My play tonight is going to be Rui Hashimura over 11.5 points against the Denver Nuggets. The Los Angeles Lakers made some adjustments in the second half, and a lot of that was seeing how Rui played on the court in the first half. Uh, getting ahead of my house a little bit here, I'm going to go back just a little bit. 28 minutes for Rui Hashimura was the most he has played in the playoffs so far. He wasn't even getting 20 minutes a game against the Warriors, and now he's seeing 28 minutes in game one against the Nuggets. The Lakers made adjustments, and I think he's a major factor in why they were able to come back in that game. He played outstanding. Came off the bench. He was able to score 17 points against the Denver Nuggets. The biggest thing I took away from that game was he was plus minus. He was plus 10 on the court. He played the most minutes off the bench, and I think he's going to play even more minutes in this game against the Nuggets because when LeBron James said, we are going to make the adjustments in his post-game conference, he is talking about Rui Hashimura in the first game. He is confident in this team. I like Rui in this game. They just played a lot better with him on the court. And if he is seeing those kind of minutes in game two, he's going to have no problem hitting this number. The lineup of Austin Reeves, Dennis Schroeder, or Lonnie Walker, Rui, LeBron, and AD played outstanding in game one. You can mix and match uh, Schroeder and Lonnie Walker. I expect that lineup to be the players who they play the majority of the game with. 
D loading played horrible in game one. So look for Rui to play a lot of minutes in game two and hit this over 11 half points. And this play is not offered right now on prize picks. I'm sure it will be closer to the game, but it is offered on FanDuel and DraftKings. So go, go check it out there if you can't find it here. Over 11 half points for Rui will be my play for tonight. All right, guys, that'll do it for our NBA player props for Thursday, May 18th, Slate of Games. If you guys enjoyed the content, please sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel below. We'll see you guys next video, and thanks for watching. Just want to let everyone know that while we do give out free picks, plays, and predictions on our YouTube channel, we also have a website for you to check out. On our website, bearsprofitplays.com, you can subscribe to the website absolutely free with an email and gain access to our written articles about upcoming sporting events. If you're really looking to make some cash, we have an option to become a member of our website. If you become a member, you will gain access to our locks of the week, which are written articles that go in-depth as to why we are picking that particular outcome. As of now, our member plays have been red hot, hitting over 60% of our plays. If you don't want to become a member, it's no sweat. We are here to try and make you guys some money. That's our main goal. So come on over to bearsprofitplays.com and subscribe for free. Check us out, follow our free picks, and see for yourself that our member plays are a great investment for you. Thanks for watching.